Lucas. Maria, are you still asleep? Valdemar, you are in my power. Awake. Awake. Awake from the trance. Look, her eye twitched. Maria. Maria, can you explain what your feelings or wishes are now? Look, her lips. For God's sake, quick. Quick. Put me to sleep or wake me. Wake and be among the living. Wake and... See her whole body's moving. Rise. Awake and live. Dead. Though she lies still, it is too late. Maria, are you with us? She does not answer. Her lips tremble no more. Dr. Mueller! Dr. Mueller, you call Mueller. She's gone. Rosa, what have you done? I... done? She was alive when I left this room. What have you done? Nothing, I... I released her from the trance. Release? Trance? Neither science nor the law recognizes these terms. What do you mean, Bulow? That this is the end of your meddling, Rosa. My patient was alive when I left this room. We agreed that she was alive. Now she's dead. I charge you with the murder of Madame Maria Valdemar. This is not just the mood of the moment. I felt it growing for some time. Ah, you've been listening to Bulo's battle. No, no, Fontaine. It was not Bulo who made my Maria appear to me in a vision. Her arms fettered with heavy chains. A piteous, pleading look on her face. This is hallucination, not sight. Was it hallucination when she cried out, Ernest, my beloved, for the sake of God, if you love me, release me. I'm neither on earth nor in heaven. Again, hallucination. You're giving your imagination free reign. Maria is still with you. This is not Maria. Not my Maria. See, all the light that was in her. You did. And I thought it would be enough. But as day after day goes by, as night follows upon night, I come more and more to the conviction that this is not she. The real Maria lives in my brain, in my heart, and in the love I bear her memory. Not in this court with the trembling lips.
accept the responsibility arising from it. Then you will issue no certificate of death. There will be none issued so long as the flicker of life remains.